I made a Minecraft bot that can build images out of blocks. It was like a year ago. You might have seen my video about it, maybe you haven't. Either way, I was recently taking a look at the code for it and noticed a few problems and things that I could improve. So today we're going to be going over those problems and try to fix them. As a quick overview of how it works, you give the bot an image. It converts the colours into the types of blocks that look the most like those colours, and builds an image in the world out of those blocks. Now that you're up to speed, let's get to work. Before we tackle the actual bot, I'm making a few changes to the console, which should make working with it a little easier. This is the new console. It has this ASCII art banner, and you can also enter commands now too. There's a progress bar for when the bot's printing an image, as well as health and hunger bars for when the bot's in survival mode. Now let's get to the point. One problem with the bot is that the colours for the blocks are outdated. When I was adding the block colours to the bot, I was going off of the textures from version 1.12. Minecraft overhauled all its textures in version 1.13, which means all the bot's colour data is outdated and needs to be updated. Last time I got all the colours for the blocks by hand using MS Paint, which was incredibly slow and prone to error. This time I'm doing it properly, by not doing it at all and creating a program to do it for me. It's pretty simple. I give the program a resource pack that contains the textures for all the blocks and a list of blocks I want the colours for. And it outputs all the colours for those blocks, which I can then copy paste into my bot. The bot can currently only use concrete, terracotta and wool blocks, but I can easily add more blocks to the bot with my new colour extracting program. I'm not sure if every block is a good idea though. Things like glazed terracotta might look a little weird. So for now, I'll start by adding powdered concrete, wooden planks, cobblestone, and a bunch of other miscellaneous blocks. When I say the colour of the block, what am I actually talking about? Blocks have textures, and textures have multiple colours. To be specific, my program gives you the average colour of the block's texture. But there are other ways of getting colours from blocks that can give us different results. We could use the most common colour instead, which looks like this. It might look better, or maybe it doesn't, I don't know. I'll just make the bot able to do both. If you have an opinion about this, let me know in the comments. I'm also going to change the way the bot measures the similarities between colours. I'm not going to explain it here, just know that this means the bot is better at picking blocks. If you want a full rundown of the commands and how to use the bot, I've updated the GitHub page. I'll see you guys in a few weeks with my next video. Consider giving this video a like, and subscribe if you haven't already.